graphs I saw, I want to give some feedback. You're seeing a few that just need to label their axes, both X and Y, and give me a title. The graphs look great. And the next one you're going to see, this person actually included a bar for the totals. Awesome. But again, I need you to label both your X and Y axes and give me a title. This next one, I just need to see that variable name along the X axis, job experience. This next person, I would look at your Y axis. You want to write number of people rather than just people. And for this bar chart, the person used the percentage symbol. Be careful. That's a relative frequency symbol when you, want, when you had frequency data. Next couple of graphs looking awesome just need a title but I love how like quick and dirty they are by hand it's awesome that's how I would have done it um, I had a few folks make different looking graphs I, I wanted to share some a couple folks made pie charts I had somebody use relative frequencies but put gender on the x-axis and that was awesome I had a couple folks do sideways bar charts and they're looking great this one my only comment would be just give me a title All right this last one this was perfect again just by hand a little highlighter loved it so when it comes to your replies, make sure you answer part B, where you're using sentences and comparing job experience and gender in terms of what you see in each category. You can do that as a separate post or included in both of your response posts to your classmates. All right, thanks so much. Bye.